Hi, CBC Music. I'm Sarah Paget from the Bar Brothers, and these are some basic techniques for the pedal harp. One of the things that's really wonderful and beautiful about the pedal harp as opposed to Celtic or lever harps, um, it's, a, it's a really full, rich tone and you have a very full range. I have all kinds of amps and wonderful things that are helping me get that full sound also, obviously, but even on its own, it's, it's really, it's got a, a roundness to it that a lot of other instruments don't have. But it's very high tension string, so there's 2,000 pounds of pressure on the soundboard, and you really have to use, it's a very physical instrument, you have to use your whole body to play it and really find a way to become quite strong in your fingers and quite relaxed in your arms to really be able to actually just like... The gesture is kind of like, you want to be clasping your hand together and then relaxing right away. That's one of the fundamentals of harp playing. Once you have that down, you can make chords pretty easily because again with the pedals you can set yourself up so that you're all in one key and you're not going to be making any mistakes. So to get started you can just play a C chord. Your, your red strings are C and your black strings are F and you can just set up a basic triad. But uh, yeah, the harp, it really, um, it functions quite a lot like a piano. So your, your low strings are down here and your highs are up here. Your left hand ends up accompanying a lot of the time while your right hand is playing melody all the time, of course, because you have to, you have to start to become like an octopus with your feet going on at the same time too. But as, as, a, as a basic, when I started learning the harp, I, I spent countless hours on my on my own in a little tiny practice cabin at, at McGill actually just just playing arpeggios which is the most satisfying thing in the world on on this instrument anyways when you're when you're learning to play the harp you you want to get your fingers functioning in just a, a relaxed fashion and and you need to have basic shapes happening in your hand, so chords, just simple chords like a C chord, an F chord, a G chord. And getting, getting those shapes in your fingers is, is a lot of the work. Those are some of my beginner ideas about how to, how to get to know the instrument. Spend, spend a lot of time getting your fingers comfortable with it and spend a lot of time messing around with your feet and, and have fun because it's a, it's a huge instrument with a huge capacity that a lot of others don't have. Let us know what you want to learn next. Like this video, comment, and don't forget to subscribe.